Hello everyone and welcome in a new video from Gadget Hunter. As I said in a previous video about the Galaxy Watch unboxing, I want to talk to you about the pre-order of Galaxy Watch in the UK. You're gonna ask why I'm doing this video. It's pretty simple. Samsung claims to be a premium brand and always compares to Apple, even laughing at Apple in their ads. Unfortunately, when it comes to real life, it looks like Samsung doesn't treat the customer seriously. But let's start from the beginning. When I decided to buy a Galaxy Watch, it was only available at the pre-order. Fair enough, but for me it was obvious that after Galaxy Unpacked event and releasing the watch to the stores for sale, they will be available at least in Samsung stores. How wrong I was. I went to Samsung store in Newcastle and I was really surprised by the bloke in the shop who told me that three weeks before the release date they don't have the watch in store. How do you want to attract people for your new watch if you don't have it in store? That was the first disappointment but as a real gadget maniac I have decided to give it a go. Mainly because of the dual wireless charger worth about 80 quid which you should receive when you buy the watch in the pre-order but we'll come back to the charger later on. The shipping date for pre-orders in the UK and the rest of the Europe was the 6th of September, so customers should receive their orders on 7th of September, which was Friday. How surprised I was when I received an email from the delivery company on Friday a week before with all shipment details. I was so happy that I would receive my watch earlier. Delivery was the next working day, so I was expecting my watch on Monday morning. Unfortunately, I spent whole Monday waiting for my watch and that was just a waste of time. Same on Tuesday. Finally, on Wednesday evening, Samsung sent me an email stating that we should ignore all information from the delivery company and the watches will be shipped on 6th of August. I'll add a screenshot of this email in a post-production. Bit too late Samsung. But this email proves that loads of people have been asking what's going on. If you think that that's the end of the story, you are wrong. The day before the delivery date on 6th of September, I did receive another email from Samsung about my delivery. Obviously, I thought it is an email about delivery arranged for the next day, and actually it was, but only partially. Samsung sent me an email about delivery date for my Samsung watch of 7th of September and my complimentary dual charger, which will arrive on 28th of September, while it's only three weeks after I received my watch. Can anyone explain me why Samsung treat their customers like that? Is any other brand behave like this? As you can see, I don't restrict myself to only one brand. I've got a MacBook and an iPad from Apple, some cameras from Sony, and my Galaxy S9 from Samsung. And honestly, that's the first time that I feel I'm not being treated seriously. Especially that we are talking about product which is called a Galaxy product. So you really expect something special. My advice for Samsung is to spend more time on planning for new product launches next time. Huge disappointment from Samsung. Thumbs down. That's it for me today. Please share your thoughts in the comment section below and subscribe my channel to make sure you're not gonna miss next video. Thanks and stay well.